when you're a startup, it's really hard to come out in an existing market. Um, so we've put together tools that um, focus on building your search performance and ranking so that you can compete with much bigger shops. Welcome to Business Ninjas, brought to you by Write For Me, where you'll hear from business leaders who are out there growing their business and slaying it every day. Learn from the masters. Let's get started. Hi, and welcome to another episode of Business Ninjas. I'm here today with Nick Hepner, technical partner at North Studio Limited. How are you doing today, Nick? I'm excellent. That's a that's a good answer. I appreciate <laughs> you appreciate you spending some time with us here today. Please tell us a little bit about yourself and about North Studio Limited. Uh, sure. Um, I am one of the owners of a company called North Studio. We are a uh, boutique West Coast uh, web development shop specializing in Drupal development. Um, uh, my background is engineering. Um, I've had uh, a long history with web development. I've been doing this um, uh, since the the late '90s, uh, and um, have worked on um, a lot of really big projects. So I've worked on um, Best Buy Mobile. I've worked on WhiteHouse.gov. I've worked on um, <laughs> a lot of university sites, most of the East Coast universities. Um, uh a handful of others right so um i'm pretty well steeped in this and our our little shop has been uh producing some really great work these last few years excellent and, and what's the origin story of north studio limited when did you guys start up shop oh that's that's interesting uh north studio started um about 20 years ago uh give or take I wasn't a part of the team at the time. Uh, and one of the owners owned a bed and breakfast. He um, submitted his marketing materials too late to make it into the periodical. So instead decided to build a website to promote his business. And then all of the other bed and breakfasts <laughs> tried to get him to build their websites. So suddenly he immediately had a web development company on his hands. <laughs> How long did the, the B and B last at that point? Oh, he's still got it. He's still running that. Uh, it was, um, from what I understand, that effort was extremely successful. Um, and he's, he's, uh, quietly, uh, living in a picturesque lagoon, uh, here in Victoria. So uh, it, it seems to have worked out pretty well for him. Yeah, he, he built a better digital mousetrap and, and they all they all showed up. Very nice. So tell us a little bit more about what you guys do and, and what sort of verticals you service. Sure. Um, typically, we focus on right now our big uh, our biggest vertical is going to be uh, medical. Uh, we work in medical research and um, develop platforms for data capture, um, as well as uh, we work with a lot of biotech. Um, we worked with uh, Microsoft on uh, some of their biotech initiatives and uh, even some of their customers for their, their grant programs. So um, uh, we also service education. Typically, we focus on, or we have historically focused on uh, Drupal development, but lately we have been working with new technologies um, such as React and Next.js and have started to even build our own platform um, to help service uh, small business and uh, small to mid-range business customers to help them with a no-code, low-code um uh very fast seo performant solution uh that they can actually manage what are the most common problems you're solving for these clients uh well for the the small business uh clients we are um 
what we've come to find uh, is that small businesses don't always have technical resources or the budget for technical resources, right? Mm -hmm. um, so they need a solution that kind of appeals to their lowest common denominator, whoever they have on staff. Um, uh, unless it's a tech shop, right? Tech shops sure. can handle their own stuff. But um, uh, the wife owns a flower company and uh, her company has, um, they have no computer people except for me. Uh, and in order to create digital content for them to promote the business, they uh, they would need to hire somebody in order to do that. Um, and that's an expense that they just can't take on or, or whatever. Many businesses are in that position. So it always falls on the admin or, you know, the owner who's already working, you know, 10 jobs, you know, to, to kind of grind that out. So um, that's the first thing that we're solving um, uh, with that platform. The second thing that we are trying to solve is that when you're a startup, it's really hard to come out in an existing market. Um, so we've put together tools that um, focus on building your search performance and ranking so that you can compete with much bigger shops. Um, so it's, it's um, so far we've seen pretty good success with it. Um, uh, we've got uh, some pretty happy clients at the moment. Uh, we're still working through some of the um, some of the bugs and issues, but by and large, the, we're all very happy with the product, and it is coming along very nicely. Excellent. Tell me about the COVID years. What has it been like trying to grow your business for the last? Oh, <laughs> COVID hurt. Um, <laughs> um, I would say that we have uh, several really great clients. Um, who persisted through COVID and really uh, stuck with us, um, even with everything going on, right? Uh, it's easy to get scared, but, um, and and kind of um, close up a bit, but we were fortunate to have good clients. That said, um, uh, through the COVID years, uh, a lot of folks decided to get into web development and the space got a lot more competitive very quickly. Mm -hmm. um, uh, which, you know, I think is actually great. I, I, you know, we should always be pushed to, to build better and better. Um, but we were put in a position where we were really forced to pivot. Um, so we have kind of been this traditional, um, boutique development shop, and we have really switched gears into um, this new model using these new technologies um, and, and really adopted um, a new attitude about how we're doing our jobs. Um, uh, we, we pivoted pretty hard and we're pretty excited about it. Um, I think pivot and digital transformation are probably the two biggest terms used in the last 24 months and, and they're legitimate. I mean, if you're not flexible or agile, uh, COVID uh, put your eyebrows at the back of your head and maybe you didn't recover from it. So pivot is a, a big word. Indeed. Yeah. Um, what, what makes North studio stand out from, from its competition? There's a couple of things. Um, one, like I said, I, I, I actually, I think this, this project that we're working on right now, this, this Northern lights product, uh, site building platform. I, uh, I've been doing this for 20 years and I actually genuinely think this is one of the, uh, best platforms, best pieces of technology I've worked on. Um, and I'm, I'm pretty excited about it. I think that the results that it delivers, uh, speak for themselves. Um, this uh, this flower shop has, um, uh, if you go year to year, uh, the first uh, Q1, um, it, we're looking at over 350% uh, conversion rate wow. increase, right? Um, our, our, our year to year revenue comparison is is just off the, off the wall. Um, so I think that's something that we definitely do better. Um, and then the other thing um, uh, is that 
uh, we're very hands-on. Uh, we get very involved in our clients' businesses. We understand our clients' businesses, um, or we, we very much strive to. Um, we're uh, very personable, very easy to get along with on the phone. And I think that that does a great job of building trust between us and our, our clients. Um, and, you know, I'm fortunate to uh, have many great employees that are really capable of, of managing and building that connection. I'm going to say in terms of trust, it's a good thing you're good at what you do, because when you use your wife's business as a guinea pig for your new platform, uh, <laughs> the potential for other uh, results or, you know, it, it could have could have gone poorly. <laughs> uh, right. we, she's had some things to say. <laughs> oh, I, I've never heard a story like that. Uh, <laughs> what value has content played in the growth of North Studio? I mean, we're in web development, right? Um, and uh, web development, there's there's a couple of things. Uh, I mean, we always hear about how content is king, right? And that's so true. Um, our job is to empower people like you, content creators, um, to take the business and put it into words and then uh, give it not just to people in a concise way, but give it to search engines in a way that um, you can really get results and see traction in, in the growth of your business. Content in my industry is growth. Um, it, it's a direct translation. I just build the pretty wrapper around what you guys write. Um, so it's it's very central to us. It's very important to us. Um and we are, you know, we always strive to make it a first-class citizen. Hey, we we like to say that content is king and distribution is queen, right? <laughs> uh, I throw conversation in there too. Uh, I'm not sure where in the the royal hierarchy that fits, but being able Normally to the court engage, jester, but that might, wouldn't uh, necessarily oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, being right. able to engage your clients and speak with them directly also is a pretty important touch point. And I, I think that our services uh, enable that as well. Excellent. Hey, uh, I, I believe that, you know, most of the world still meets remotely. I know people are returning to shaking hands, but your website has to live and breathe and, and content is the means by which we get that done. So that's a, that's another thing that um, came out of COVID that uh, was, was pretty important. Um, I've always told people that a uh, website isn't really an option for your business. It's a, it's a budget line item, right? Um, it comes out of your pocket every month, every quarter, every whatever, just build it in. Um, but COVID really, really cemented that in. Mm -hmm. it's an it's not just a website it is constantly curating it it's, is it's your storefront it, yeah, yeah it has to be up to date it's the especially during covid it was the only way that people were able to interact with your business for the most part we speak the same language my friend all right <laughs> fast forward a year from today what what would you like to be celebrating personally and professionally oh probably taking my first nap uh, <laughs> uh, again you know we're kind of still in the very early stages of this platform um we probably want to get uh our first 100 clients on it in this coming year um uh that's what i'd like to be celebrating um you know of course being better health and and uh you know get into a solid routine around that um and I would like to be in a growth phase for North Studio and this platform. Right now, because of COVID, we kind of been, uh, we sat back and kind of took a lay of the land, pivoted hard, went into this new project. Um, and we've been in a construction phase for that. Um, and now I, I really think it's very important that we start engaging customers on a much bigger scale. Excellent. All right. Well, please tell us what your URL is, where people can find North Studio Limited and what social media outlets you're using. Sure. Days. It'll be northstudio.com. Um, we are on Instagram uh, and I think it's at North Studio. Um, we are on Facebook for some reason. 
<laughs> Very engaged, I see. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't I don't handle that piece of it, but um uh yeah, northstudio.com. We see uh all of our farm requests, we we read them all, we you know, um uh, respond to everybody with you know legitimate inquiries or conversations. Um and uh you know we've um uh, we're a pretty low key shop, so engaging with us is uh, it's not complicated. It's not committal. We're 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 just you know, um, I mean we 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 live on an island off the west coast of Canada. Like you, you really can't get more easy going than that. <laughs> Nick Hepner of North Studio, thank you for spending some time with us on Business Ninjas. I wish you and yours and North Studio all the best in the future. Hey, thanks a lot. Appreciate your time, Andrew. Thank you. Be well.